The EPA states that there was 4.1 million tons of disposable diaper waste going to landfills as of 2018. This is the number that is commonly cited throughout the internet, but is it really accurate? I think that the reality actually could be double, triple, or maybe even quadruple this number. How does the EPA arrive at the 4.1 million tons number to begin with? This is said to account for both baby diapers and adult diapers. The growing aging population of the planet continues to increase, as well as the prevalence of incontinence issues across all ages. As a result, the adult diaper market is much larger now than it was just five years ago. Diver waste is tracked and calculated through waste management systems. Their quantity can be measured through landfill weigh-ins and waste audits. But a harder and more solid metric that we could take a look at would be gross sales figures. We'll get to some of that information in just a minute. Oftentimes, articles and news segments that cover this problem don't often consider the amount of adult diaper waste there may actually be. I believe this stems from the overall culture of secrecy that the entire adult diaper market seems to have ingrained within it. If we aren't comfortable talking about these things, then how can we ever discuss the mountains of adult diapers going to landfills. Just to put that in perspective, I wear an average of three adult diapers per day. In one year, that equals 1,095 adult diapers that weigh anywhere from two to three pounds. To put that in other words, that's one to one and a half tons of waste. With just this one equation, we can see that if there's anywhere from 10 to 20 million US adults that need to wear diapers full time, this would make the waste problem many multiples of what the EPA is telling us. The National Association for Continents estimates that around 25 million Americans suffer with some form of incontinence issue. Another number we could take a look at is the one proposed by the Urology Care Foundation. They say that a quarter to a third of all men and women in the U.S. suffer from urinary incontinence or bladder problems. If they are correct, and it is in the 25% range, that puts us at 65 million adults with some form of bladder or incontinence issues. Of course, not all of these people are going to need or want to use diapers to manage their issues. So how can we potentially figure out how many people are actually wearing diapers? According to globalnewswire.com, in 2020, the U.S. sold 260 million units of adult diapers. Assuming one unit equals one package of diapers, oftentimes a single package is about 10 diapers. That puts us at at least 2.6 billion used diapers per year. On the high end, and some brands have 15 to 20 diapers per package. At 15 diapers per package, that puts us at 3.9 billion diapers per year. And at 20 diapers per package, that comes out to 5.2 billion diapers per year. Now, if we just take the 25 million and say just 10 million of them need to wear diapers full time, which brings us to 11 billion used adult diapers per year. If we go with roughly 6 million adults are bedwetters and need to wear one diaper a day, that comes out to 2.2 billion used diapers per year. When we add these two rather conservative estimates together, this brings us to roughly 16 million tons of adult diaper waste per year. The diaper waste problem may actually be a lot bigger than we all think. No matter how big or small this problem actually is, I think we can do better than just discarding them to landfills for future generations to have to deal with. Needing to wear diapers for any reason is already mentally challenging enough without the weight over recognizing the amount of waste having these needs may cause. For more on how wearing diapers affects us mentally, check out this video next. If you got any value out of this video and you want to see what the potential solutions are to diaper waste, be sure to subscribe, hit that like button, and until next time, Stay dry.